everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Eka Ferry and today we are talking about this La Roche-Posay eye cream. I'm honestly surprised this hasn't gone more viral yet because it's so so good. So first of all this is especially formulated for very sensitive skin and especially if you're prone to irritation or extreme dryness around the eyes this is going to save you because it's not scented and it's so so hydrating and soothing. This obviously contains uh, thermal water, uh, like basically all their products do, and it's so, so hydrating, like I cannot stress this enough. I also love about it the fact that it comes with a little pump, so you can just pump how much you need, and the, the texture is so soft it will get absorbed in literal seconds and I love to use this product especially after I wear a lot of eye makeup and a lot of concealer under my eyes or if I just wear a lot of makeup in general because I feel like especially after double cleansing my eye area is kind of irritated you know like my eyes aren't really having it and this product just saves them every time I know it's summer and a lot of us just tend to forget how important moisturizing is and especially for the eyes I feel like eye creams are just neglected uh, during, <laughs> during summer this one is going to be a little bit pricier uh, than other eye creams that are on the market right now but I don't personally think you can find an alternative to how calming and soothing this eye cream is so if you're looking for something to calm irritation and to really hydrate in a very very gentle way this is a must I'm really great I got my hands on it and I'm really excited to hear from you guys if you've tried it or if you're going to try and what your thoughts are now, uh, like the downside of this eye cream, like I wouldn't call it a downside, but I just want to point it out so this review is uh, throughoutly honest, I guess, is the fact that it will not really like uh, illuminate your under eye area, okay? So it will keep it hydrated, very moisturized, but you know, as I've been saying with other eye creams, it's really, it's not, I mean, it's not really the case for this eye cream to totally brighten up your under eye area or your eyelids and also it will not really get rid of the fine lines that need um, a different type of eye cream for example one c containing uh, retinol okay so this is uh, for the fine lines that are just due to dehydration and irritation it's not going to tackle any kind of retinoid needing uh, aspects of your skin but I would definitely use this on top of any kind of uh, retinoids, uh, especially when it comes to the eye area, because I know usually eye creams are formulated in a more gentle way to not really irritate your eye area, but if you're using retinol, uh, this you, you will kind of need something to really soothe and calm down the skin. Now, if you are in fact using retinol or any kind of retinoid on your face, uh, I am currently not, but I would suggest you use this uh, eye cream to kind of protect your under eye area because you know you are supposed to apply a specific, like a very moisturizing moisturizer uh, under your eyes so they don't get irritated from the face retinoid and also I think I would uh, use this a lot if I used any kind of under eye retinol as well so make sure to look into this if you fall under these categories if you, or if you just have very sensitive dry irritated skin like mine let me know if you've tried this and stay tuned for the next product review you can find all the products that i love and use in a playlist that should appear somewhere around the screen and also i want to thank you a lot for watching don't forget to subscribe like and i'll see you next time bye